chaos, mayhem, and destruction. <laughs> good old fashioned. I'll let Connor explain it. Yeah, some good old fashioned hit to pass racing where uh, trade some paint if you want to get by the guy in front of you and. You know, try to not to put him into the wall too hard, but just a little bit. The hit automotive restoration TV series, Rust Valley Restores, sped through the Penticton Speedway, with the crew getting a taste for our local track. I think it was awesome. It was my first time at Penticton Speedway. JF kind of chose that um, venue because it was his home track, and he wanted to be able to bring us there and try to teach us about the track. And I hear they're doing a bunch of work there this year, and they're going to continue racing there for a little while longer so it's a good yeah. thing because most of the tracks around bc keep shutting down or stuff like that happens and yeah. it's glad I'm, I'm glad the penticton's managing to keep theirs open yeah and actually one of the highlights of the year was when jf tried to give me some lessons in the van and he started screaming like a little girl while the show usually focuses on repairing and creating beautiful cars their time at the speedway was focused more on demolition and racing that's the whole purpose I mean, it's not like we bring show cars there. I mean, you know, we splash them. We try and make them look a little uh, out of uh, the ordinary. But the whole point is to smash them yeah. well, and race. So there's, there's two points. They've got to last long enough to finish the race. But, I mean, they are somewhat sacrificial. The challenges with filming the show during a pandemic were present, but the team was glad to be able to get out into BC a bit. What made it special is the fact we finally got away from here during COVID and actually got out to have some fun but uh the people there were very friendly very accommodating we almost killed a couple guys but other than that we had a great time you can spot the speedways appearances in episode seven and eight of season three for castanet news in penticton i'm casey richardson (laughs) 